Hello everybody, it's Lee aka Outpost 51 with the Paranormal Fellows this evening as we return to Antwerp Mansion in Manchester. It's a uh, traditional Manchester evening where it's pretty grey and dreary outside but you know we make do and it's very warm in here today as well. So the last time we were here was in like 2019 and a fair bit has changed. So here we are in the blue room. Now we go into the main dance hall area. The bar there. Oh, there we are, the prices are still up on the board. Uh, this place was a infamous rave nightclub venue from like 2008 until 2019. So we came the first time, not long after it shut down. Very interesting location, folks. This is the main stage. Better, uh, you can't see that, but it's stuff that would light up under UV. I wouldn't like to take a UV lap around this place though. Drum kit in the corner, if you can just make that out. <clears throat> the main stage, DJ Dex. Let's take up the top. Try not to fall through the floor as I'm doing it. <laughs> and this is where DJs would have overseen the carnage. So, Chloe and Dan are sorting out some oh. CCTV for us. Oh. Grab it. So we behind this with that. Or on top of it, either one. Yeah, I'll do. This is that leather piano. And this was the old reception area back in the day. An amazing place. Gives off a great vibe. Before we go upstairs, let's go into the basement. Anybody scared of dolls? I don't know when the light goes out and you wander around this corner and just see them looking at you. But this is where they do, um, I'm going to keep all their materials and stuff because I was talking to the guy and he makes prop weapons based on Lord of the Rings. Pretty cool to see really. Small equipment there. The throne. Now where we were here last time, uh, this throne was upstairs in the main hall which I'll show you shortly. And then this room here, that table was there. It's very like butcher shop esque, isn't it? And um, yeah, since we've been, a pentagram has been drawn on a table. Crudely, I might add, not perfect. Fake skeleton. Trust me, it is fake. Don't panic, folks. Don't write in the comments. Oh my god, this is skeleton there. But yeah, it's pretty quiet down here. Should be very little noise contamination. <clears throat> and then we go through the supermarket style doors into this room where who knows what goes on down here. <laughs> yeah, you have a fair idea of what goes on in here, potentially. And then a mirror, which I think we used last time for scrying. Back through the supermarket style doors. You can ask Jordan why I'm calling him that because it reminds him of quick save apparently. He's a weird boy. Right. Are we not better off on that corner? So downstairs. The main staircase going up. 
Amazing, amazing work which was there last time. Into another room. You've gone out in there, you skip away. Just put it through the massive hole there, that's the one. I'm using fat spaces, isn't it? And on that bombshell. <laughs> My apologies. Yeah. As I can see, this is like an old, uh, old, an artist space now. So regularly they change up the exhibitions, etc. And it's just for people, creative people, to come and basically go nuts, create whatever they want to create. Some old vinyl in the corner there. Tempted to sift through to see what gems they got. Old hi-fi. So this room on the left is our base room. And then we go into the main upstairs hall. Fair bit has changed since the last time we were here. Uh, the stage used to be a lot more prominent, it used to come out a fair way. And the throne that I showed you all earlier, that was parked on that. But you do get crack invisibility in here. Oh, focus. Focus. There we are. Floor in the best, best shape, mine, so we'll have to watch out in the dark. And then to round it all off, we got this little corner here. Which used to be, I think they used to be toilet stalls. But there we go. There we are, folks. That's a brief overview of Antwerp Mansion. The full episode, obviously, will be up when it's ready. Hope you enjoy.